Oh, here it is, the Seiko. This is just uh, some video footage I shot earlier today because I'm doing a fun little video about this watch and its bigger brother and also a new Seiko 5 that I just bought. Um, you can see this watch is in awesome shape. I bought it not too long ago with the intention of modifying it, but it's too nice to modify, really. It's perfect. Um, it looks exquisite, and I just could not bring myself to open it up because look at this thing. It's so nice. Um, really no scratches or even rub marks or anything on the case. The crystal, the Hardlex crystal, is completely scratch-free. I think in the video there might be a speck of dust on it. Um, it runs great just spins right up. You see the back of the case there. It's definitely real. Uh, examined it and also put that serial number into a Seiko watch checker. It came back as manufactured in 2017, sold in 2018, so it's pretty new. Um, yep, that's it. Oh shoot, I almost forgot that I actually did some loom shots of this thing. So I held it in the sun for like um, literally 10 seconds and then popped into a closet. I think my iPhone's camera really cranked up. You can see it's really grainy. It really cranked up the, uh, the exposure. But rest assured that loom is crazy bright. Uh, way brighter than my Seiko 5, that's for sure. And there it is. There's Seiko 5. It's pretty bright, but it really does not compare to that. It's epic. Yeah, I gotta admit, you're kind of making me wish I uh, maybe should have kept it. <laughs> All right.